Hey guys, what is going on? Jurgen from Zerk Reno Sports here, and today we're back at it again with some more of our SmackDown Raw 2008 GM Mode series. Uh, now, before we get into this, I am a little bit sick, so if I sound a little bit different or I have to clear my throat a bunch, that's why. I do apologize. Um, <clears throat> Seems like all my friends are getting sick now, so I don't know what it is. Uh, the weather's been pretty shitty, I guess maybe that might be it, but I don't know. Um, let's take a look at what we did last week before we get into things. Uh, we got a three and a half star show rating. We, um, we have this that's like kind of a rivalry, but not really a rivalry, so I don't know why I'm doing it, but I'm doing it because I want to build up my tag division. Even though I don't have a tag division, but I want to make a tag division, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I should probably make an actual rivalry out of these two, so it uh, it gets ratings. Um, you know what? I might go ahead and just do that. Why the fuck not? You know, let's you know why not? Why not? You know, why not? You know what I'm saying? Uh, no balls. You know that got three and a half. <clears throat> then we had a two on one. Uh, Chavo and Shelton versus Ray that got four stars. Nice. Uh, Helms and John Cena only got three and a half. Don't really know how, but okay, because uh, both of them are popular. It's a rivalry. It's all that. So don't know why that only got three and a half, but that's okay. And then we had this right here. Uh, Randy vs. HBK with uh, each of their respective tag partners in their corners. Randy picking up the W over the show. Stoppa, you know what I'm saying? I got three and a half. And then the main event of the evening was the Rockin' MVP versus the Undertaker. Um, I forgot to specify in the last episode. I did specify in the one before it. Uh, basically, two weeks ago, MVP put Undertaker in the casket in the backstage in the parking lot brawl, thought he got rid of him, Undertaker, and he would have cut a promo last week being like, oh, I need a new challenger, <laughs> and then the, the gong would hit, and then Undertaker would come out and be like, oh, tonight you'll rest in peace, and then MVP would scramble backstage to find somebody to help him fight Undertaker uh, by promising them, like, I don't know, a title shot or something if they help him take out the Undertaker, so The Rock jumped at the opportunity. I don't think I specified the world title thing two weeks ago either, but that is what I meant to say. I'm just I'm very forgetful. That got four. Undertaker picking up the win, of course. Um, I think we lost that week to Raw because Raw had we all had the same rating, but they had a four and a half there. Yeah, so <clears throat> yeah, let's see what Raw and ECW did this week though. Raw got four. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna be hard for us to top a four star. Okay, ECW got three. That's not too bad. Batista's their champion. He beat Kali for it. Okay. Okay. Okay, uh, and then that's our show that we have to book. Let's go ahead and take a look at the roster. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's go ahead and take a look at the roster like I usually do. Let's let's look at what our popularity is like. So Jeff is still at 100, which I'm actually kind of shocked by because he hasn't been in the world title picture for... Never mind, only for like a few weeks, so that's not a big shock actually, is it? <clears throat> oh well. MVP at 100, of course, still the world champ. Ray is also at 100. Punk's at 99. Triple H is at 99. Undertaker is 99. Gregory Helms 93. Randy 93. Chavo 92. The Rock 92. Sean 90. Cena's. Cena's only 87. What the fuck? What? Really? Really? He's only 87? Really? 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 Okay. Uh, Matt at 87 makes sense. He was really high up for a while for some reason. Uh, Shelton up to 85. That's nice to see. Stone Cold's only at a 78. Jesus. Okay. Um, and Edge is only at a 73. So I got to build those guys up. <clears throat> I might take this week to do some popularity boosts instead of the money. But I'll wait and see how our money situation ends up. Maybe the week that The Rock is renewed. I don't know when that is. I'll check right now. Kenny's at a 65, of course, because Kenny's just trash. Um, oh, this is The Rock's week. Okay, so I, I probably won't need to do some money stuff this week. I can probably just do some um, other stuff. I think I did say that I wanted to renew somebody else along with... 
The Rock, though. Um, and I'll think about that, but I probably won't do it. <laughs> I'll probably go back on my plan. Um, current champions, as you can see there, Ray is Cruiserweight MVP World Champion, and Sean and Triple H DX are the tag champions. Of course, US title is vacant. Uh, Gregory Helms and John Cena having a best of seven series for it, which will culminate at the Great American Bash. Um, we take a look at our rivalries here. This has three thumbs up on ten weeks. That's nice. Uh, this has two weeks, this has two weeks, and that has three weeks. For the meme, we will um, we'll do another two-on-two. Two. Uh, what was this one? Patriotism. Who's in the match? I don't think that'll work. Nobody else? What is this? Against all odds? I don't think anybody qualifies for that. But it's three stars, so that's good to know. Um, the fuck? Divas team up? Nope, they're not Divas. Team Canada? Nope, can't do that. What is this? Faction? I thought we passed that earlier. Or was that Diva Faction? That's what it was. Wow, that's sexism, dude. <laughs> um, there's, uh, there was another one over here. What the fuck? We already passed them? Hold up. There, there was one called Rookie Partners or something. Yeah, that's a one star. Fuck no. Okay, let's uh, let's try against all odds and hope for the best. I guess. <laughs> okay, uh, Punk and Stone Cold versus Jeffrey and Matthew. Cruiserweight superstar does not qualify. What do you mean? We have two cruiserweights. Three cruiserweights with Punk. God damn it. So we're going to have to do rookie partners, aren't we? Fuck. <laughs> That's not going to be good. Oh, no. Okay, well. Uh, Jeff and Matt. And uh, Punk and Stone Cold. This is going to leave us kind of short. But we're only going to do it to Great American, Great American Bash. <clears throat> Excuse me. We're only going to do it that short anyways. So it doesn't really matter. All right, let's go ahead and book our show. We didn't book it at the end of the last episode because I didn't have it ready. But I do have it ready this week, obviously. Otherwise, I wouldn't be able to do an episode. Um, we will start off with uh, with a cruiserweight match. That's not what I want. Bada boom, bada bing. <clears throat> we got your boy Ray. We got uh, Chavito in the corner of who? 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 Kenny Dykstra. That's right, boy. That's right, boy. Kenny Dykstra. Second match. Uh, it will be... Uh, <clears throat> one of these with... <clears throat> excuse me. Excuse me. Again, with my throat. My bad. Um, I don't know why I did it this way. I could have just turned it around, but it's this way in my spreadsheet. Um... Oh, Punk has to be there anyways. Wow, literally two of the people were there. I, I just, I did extra clicks. <clears throat> okay, so Matt versus Stone Cold this time, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, look at that. I'm very smart, dude. I'm very, um, you know, I'm very innovative, you know? I, I, don't, I don't just do the tropes that people usually do, you know? Why would I do that, you know? Why on earth would I do that? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, man? You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> uh, he's against Triple H. Bada boom, there we go. And then we're going to put Sean there. There you go. Uh, match number four. Guess what? MVP went out and got so even more help. Uh, trio or three... To tag, okay, so trio should be the one where they have to tag in and out. I hope. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? Undertaker there. Uh, Shelton coincidentally is one of the people. The Rock is another, and MVP is the last one. There you go. And then uh, another advertising promo because we need that money. That money, you know what I'm saying? 
And then in the main event of the evening will be the third match of <clears throat> John Cena and Gregory Helms' rivalry best of seven series. They will be main eventing for their halfway point of the match. Well, not really halfway, but <clears throat> you know what I mean? Like kind of halfway, but kind of not halfway because odd numbers and stuff. You know what I mean? You know you know yeah man whatever okay that will be our show for this week you know what i'm saying looking pretty good we'll go ahead and confirm that obviously and uh we will go ahead and play this first match and uh unfortunately we're gonna be playing as your boy kenny dykstra you know what i'm saying you, you uh, if you've been subscribed for a while if you've been watching this channel for a while you will know that uh, I'm not a big fan of Kenny Dykstra, you know, because he's shit, because uh, he's shit, and oh, of course, most importantly, because he's shit. So, um, given the fact that he is shit, we're going to go ahead and crack open a cold one with the boys dead meme to help ensure our victory against somebody who's not shit in Rey Mysterio, because <laughs> if, if we're being honest, I'm going to need all the help I can get. <laughs> we'll, we'll skip Ray's entrance. You know what I'm saying? Please sponsor me, dude. It's so good. And, you know, my throat also needs assistance. Not only Kenny needs assistance today. My throat needs some assistance, too. Alright. Kenny with Chavo, of course. Of course. Of course. We're not watching that. We're not watching that, though. <laughs> we are not watching Kenny's entrance. Are you kidding me? Fuck out of here. Fuck out of here. <clears throat> All right. Hopefully, Ray doesn't give us too much trouble. I feel like he will, but you know, one can hope. A man can dream. Oh yeah, you like that fucking little bitch? Oh oh no! Oh stop! Yeah, look at that. I'm faster than you, even though I there, I have no right to be. Ooh ooh. What's this? What's this? Slingshot. Bada boom. Oh, dude, that hurts your throat, you know what I'm saying? Got him. Oh, no. Can he roll? Can Kenny roll? He can't roll. Of course he can't roll. He's useless. Alright. Come on, bro. Oh, no. Yikes. Oof. Big oof. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Stop. Stop. Oh, look at that. Nice. Come on, bro. Yeah, stomp his ass. Yeah, stomp his ass. Stomp his ass real good, dude. Oh, look at that. Poke in the eyes. Fuck you, dude. Get the fuck. Oh, no. It's over. Oh, okay, good. The hitboxes fucked him over. No, they didn't that time, though. Oof, monkey flip. Please don't. Please don't. Ray? Ray? Ooh, I actually reversed that. I don't know how, because I can't reverse strikes to save my life, but whatever. Nice old chop block there, you know what I'm saying? Get your ass up. Let me... Oh, okay. 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 All right. You don't want to... Here, Chavo, help me out, man. Are you taunting against me? I'll chop block you again, dude. I know you got the weak knees. I know you're weak in the knees, Ray. Ooh, that's... Uh, that... Okay. I'm whooping his ass. I really shouldn't be, but... I am, and that's... I'm happy because I'm winning, but I'm also very disappointed because I've put myself in this situation where Rey Mysterio has to lose to Kenny fucking Dykstra. So, <laughs> it's, uh, it's not too good. Not too good, you know? <clears throat> Boom, look at that. Dude, I actually got a finisher already. Can he hit the finisher? Oh my god, he didn't reverse it. Is this gonna be it? This is gonna be it. Please kick out. You're not at red anything. Please kick out. Please kick out. Good, he kicked out. Thank God. Hey, I can argue with the ref now, too. That gives me some momentum, I think, right? That was a nice chunk of momentum, actually. Who? Look at that nice old chop block. Doing a lot of those, you know. Weak knees. Gotta target the, uh, the knees. He reversed my elbow drop. Of course he did. Of course he did, you know. Oh, what a low blow, dude. I've always, I've never understood why low blows weren't, uh, weren't DQs in the game. Oh shit, he reversed me. Whoops. That nice old wheelbarrow fucking 
uh, bulldog. Uh, I like the kick out of this. I hate when the when the CPU rolls you up. It's like an automatic two and a half. Like you can't kick out before it, which is bullshit. Because you have a heart attack and you're like, did I actually lose? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay. I think this has happened once or twice before, but I seriously just grappled over Ray because he's so short and got the rep. That's actually hilarious. Jesus. Alright, bruh. He keeps going top rope, and like, I don't think he even has the showboat ability active, so taunting and doing the top rope move doesn't even get him a full momentum bar. So they're like, I don't get it. Like, I don't get it at all. I'll get him with- oh, he's- I get- I keep getting mad that he's reversing, but then I think to myself, oh, that makes sense, he's good, I'm not, so... Yeah, I'm used to playing with good people, so playing as somebody as shit as Kenny Dykstra is, uh... Ooh, look at that, I don't even know what the fuck to call that. I don't even know what the fuck to call that move, but I know how to- Okay, he reversed the elbow drop, again. <laughs> God damn it. Alright. He's, uh, he's whooping my ass, though, I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what. Kenny's actually, like, not a low rating in this game, though, because I think this is one of the first games where they started doing, like, everybody's high rated. Um, and then, more recently, they started doing, you know, if you're shit, we're gonna rate you shit. Well, shit within kayfabe, I guess, not shit within, um, like, realistic, like, wrestling ability, because there are some wrestlers who are just shit and rated higher than wrestlers who are good, but, you know. They, uh, they have to do the ratings on kayfabe, which is, which makes sense, but, I don't know. At least they give you the option to change them, oh, that's what I do, I just go in and change them every, uh, every year. He's gonna beat me, isn't he? Like, it's not the end of the world if he beats me, it's just like, for the integrity of, of my rivalry, I don't want to lose? Oh no. Um, don't store it though. Ooh, don't store it, 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 don't store it. Nope, nope. Ah, he fucking stored it. Now he has the roll up. Um, here, just pin him like this. Just, just, or submit him out here. Yeah, look at that. Ooh, look at that. <clears throat> Fuck, man. Am, am I beat up enough to get pinned, or am I orange still? I'm not limping, so I must be orange still. So if I pin him now... I should be fine. Just keep him out there. Yeah, good good thinking, Chavo. Just beat his ass up. Let let me win by count out. Chavo, get him. Get him. Chavo, man. <clears throat> oh, no. Yeah, I'm only orange. Okay, so I should kick out, please. Oh, no. Uh, I'm going to store this so I can have an automatic reversal just in my arsenal. Stop, dude. Get the fuck out of here, Ray. Oh, wait, okay, if I can win with this, that's actually perfect, because this doesn't run the risk of getting rolled up. No, he kicked out of it. Of course he did. Of course he did, dude. No, no. Nick Patrick, you motherfucker. Leave me alone, dude. Nick Patrick, get the hell out of the way, dude. He keeps reversing, man. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like I'm trying to win. I'm trying to win. <clears throat> oh, come on, man. How does Rey Mysterio have a longer reach than Kenny Dykstra, dude? Really? Bro, just hit him. Oh my god, he's so short that every time... <sighs> All my fucking strikes hit over him. Because when you kick him in the stomach and he has to sell it, he's too short to get hit. It's, I hate that. I hate that so much. Oh my god, dude, just let me fucking... Just... There we go, okay? Now pin him. He reversed it. Instead of rolling me up, he reversed it. Oh my god, and now he's gonna hit me. If he hits me one more time in my abdomen, I'm gonna get to redhead health, and that's just, like, match lost off the bat. <clears throat> Dude, stop reverse. Oh no, this is it. Yep, nope. That's... Oh, I'm still orange. I'm still orange. I've still got a fighting chance. I've still got a fighting chance, dude. I still got a fighting chance. Don't hit me again, though, because if you hit me again this time, it probably will be orange. Get the fuck out of here, dude, you piece of trash. Piece of... Roll him up, roll him up, roll him up. Ref, count it. Ref, 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 count the goddamn pin, please. It's over, there we go. I avoided the possum pin, thank God. <laughs> and that makes sense to, as to how Kenny would actually have to win a match. He'd actually have to roll right up. I don't think even to put Chavo over anybody in their right mind would have him win 
by dominating him if they had the choice. Obviously, within the games, I don't have a choice. But, you know, I still made it work, you know what I'm saying? Uh, let's just get Kenny off our screen, because I, I hate him. He's just so trash. But I persevered thanks to this peace tea, dude. Please sponsor me. Okay. Um, next match is this, and I'll simulate this because I honestly do not give a shit about the results. Whoa, Matt Hardy beats Stone Cold. That's actually not good because Stone Cold's already not popular, and he should be. So I got to fix that. <clears throat> I will play this because the whoever wins this match actually does matter for the, for the rivalry, I guess, in a way. That will be uh, announced, um, you know, further down the line. Further down the line. That's what I'll say. Tori Wilson career highlights. You you know it's you know you, you know it's sad, right? And you know, you could tell the state of a company's booking of women's wrestling where career highlights don't include championship wins. They include uh, posing for Playboy. You know, what I mean, that's the sign of the times. You know. And uh, now we have Evolution. Which is a good thing, so <clears throat> hopefully it keeps going, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully it keeps on going. Tony Chimmel, so goddamn loud. Holy shit, Tony Chimmel. Tony Chimmel. He doesn't even, ha he doesn't even say rated R superstar in this game. He doesn't even say it like that, he's just rated R superstar. It's like, that's not, that's not Tony Chimmel. That's not the Tony Chimmel I know. You kidding me? That ain't Tony Chimmel. My Tony Chimmel blows a fucking vein when he says superstar, dude. <clears throat> Unrealistic. Unrealistic portrayal of a, of a likeness, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> I really, really dislike that they have a generic entrance, though. That's I, I'm going to mention it every time because they have the Titan Tron, they have the theme, but they don't have the entrance, and it's like why, why? Like I mean, this game came out in 07. They would have been, they would have still been a tag team by then, I think. I think so. So it, they really should be together. Um, they should really have a tag team entrance, but. I guess not. At least DX does. Imagine if it's just like the DX like fucking graphics on the screen and shit, but it's just like them generic face entrance. That would be the worst. <clears throat> Gotta love DX, dude. Not in 2018 though. Not in 2018. Didn't want to see that. Didn't even... Full disclosure, I did not watch Crown Jewel. <laughs> I had no intentions to. Um... And it's a good thing I didn't, because I would have lost my fucking mind if I was watching that live. Because Braun apparently got squashed by Brock, which on its own is bad, but I kind of get it because Brock versus AJ would be better than Braun versus AJ at Survivor Series. So short term, that's the better decision. The squashing isn't, but the whoever wins is the better decision short term. Long term, it's stupid because, you know, Braun really should be champion. Brock should not be involved at all. Um, <clears throat> the thing that really pisses me off is what the fuck they did with the World Cup. You know what I'm saying? They had such a good opportunity to make it a real World Cup of wrestling. But instead, they were like, hey, every single participant's American. So I had an issue with that right off the bat, right? And then two people, and then John Cena pulled out because he wanted to protect his Hollywood brand or whatever. Um, and then they put in Bobby Lashley, whatever. You could tell Bobby was going to lose his first match because Bobby's injured reportedly. So, whatever. Um, so Dolph makes it to the final. Your boy Miz makes it to the final. And fucking out of nowhere, hey, Miz can't wrestle. Shane, you wrestle. And Shane beats Dolph Ziggler. And becomes the quote-unquote best wrestler in the world. I wish he never came back, man. In 2016, when he fucking came back on that episode of Raw, I was hype as shit. Now, I wish he never fucking came back, dude. The fucking, they, like, as good as the match was at Mania between him and AJ, they made him look like a better wrestler than a bunch of the people AJ has wrestled that are full-time wrestlers. He puts himself over other people 
over other people. Like, that rivalry with Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn was just him putting himself over pretty much. Um, so that was annoying. Uh, so yeah. <laughs> Not a fan of Shane McMahon anymore. Why did I lose momentum for that? I am a fucking heel. Why did I lose momentum for a heel maneuver if I am a heel? This game makes no sense. I hate it. You know what I mean? Like, fuck, man. Just stomp his ass. Wow, he's already at yellow head and body. I'm killing him. What the fuck is this? This is legendary difficulty. He really should be putting on... A much bigger fight than this. Um, <laughs> this is really. I'm killing him, dude. Is this is this gonna actually happen this quick? Oh my god, no way, dude. Am I actually gonna squash Edge? He's orange, so he should kick out. That's fine. <laughs> oh god. Okay, no, he didn't kick out. Okay, that's. How long was that? Like 20 seconds? 30 seconds? <laughs> oh no. I fucking buried him, dude. <laughs> That's so bad. That is that is not good. That is no bueno. We're gonna Wow. So I wanted to win with Triple H. I didn't really want the 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 utter destruction of Edge. Uh, or the burial or anything. Here's the thing though, Edge is a 94 rated, right? So, just, and it's on Legend. He should not have been beaten that quick. That's so bad. Oh my god, okay. Well, you know what, that, it kind of makes up for it, because uh, this match is going to take fucking forever, because it's me versus three goddamn people. Um... <clears throat> But I'm gonna be a bitch about it. I'm gonna I'm gonna turn off uh, DQ. You know, I'm gonna turn DQs off, and uh, they're gonna be my insurance plan. You know, insurance policy. Excuse me. So if I do end up getting my ass whooped, you know, just uh, you know, sneak out of the ring, grab a good old chair, break it over some people's heads, and you know, it's uh, it's all done and dusted. You know, Undertaker gets his victory. <clears throat> I only have this rivalry booked till uh, Great American Bash, I think. I only did like a one month for it because I didn't know what I wanted to do with my world title. I think I figured it out now. Um, we are skipping Undertaker's entrance. I do not want to be a thousand years old by the time I start this match. Um, I have like I have like plans written down in like a notebook, but I haven't translated them to my Excel spreadsheet yet uh, in terms of actual matches. But I have like the over like the, the outline I guess of the feuds that I want to do so it's just uh, it's just a matter of putting them in my spreadsheet and making matches that aren't repetitive within the games like algorithm and stuff like that that'll get me good ratings <clears throat> what the rock is cooking. The Rock's cooking up a big fat L today, boys. You know what it is. You know what it is. That's what The Rock's cooking. A big fat L. <clears throat> Who's the third person? Oh, is it MVP? I think it is. Oh, you know what time it is, dude. You know what time it is. You know what time it is. One, two. You hear the clock ticking. Tick top. You about to stop living. Tick top. I want you to remember me. Tick top. But the dead know him to remember. I'm coming. Nobody can stop me, nobody can hold me, nobody can control me, I'm coming. I'm here to do my thing, I'm here to bring the pain, I'm never ever gonna change like Tropicana. I got the juice, you know what I'm saying, he's got the juice. <clears throat> he's gonna lose today though. Hate to, hate to say it, but uh, your boy MVP, you know, the MVP of SmackDown, of WWE, of the, the entire world, and whatever the fuck I used to say that I forgot what I said before but whatever you know he's he's gonna be the MVP of the of the loss column after this I'll tell you what I'll tell you what big fat all coming his way <clears throat> I hate the generic signs in the game like just like the the guy behind me can't see <laughs> it's like okay like that's good job you were too lazy to put real signs in so you put shit like that in Am I on TV? Nice. Fantastic. Why does MVP not have any actual signs? None of these are his! There's an Undertaker one. 
There's a there's a there's a divas poster, but there's no women in the match. What the fuck? Does MVP not have crowd signs in this game? Well, <laughs> I mean it's the first game he's in, so maybe that's why. But I don't know. Whatever. <clears throat> this is gonna be hell on earth, though. This is gonna suck, dude. I don't even know if I played the one on two last week. I might have simulated and and hoped for the best, but uh, this week I'm playing it. And uh, yeah, <clears throat> come on, come on, Shelton, come on, Shelton, come on, Shelton. You ain't got shit on under. Oh no, he's okay. No, he's whooping my ass right off the bat, dude. What is this? Oh no. <clears throat> That's not good. That's not good. Stop. Bro. Bro. Sean Benjamin's whooping my ass, dude. I might have to I might have to resort to the weapons earlier than I thought. Boom, look at that. Nice old DDT. Let me just hit your boys out of the ring. Come on, MVP. There you go. It's your turn now, sir. No, he's gonna take a third one. Oh no. Ooh, look at that. Yeah, fucking get him. Ooh. Oh no. Oh no. What the fuck? D stop. Dude, I have a finisher. Okay, just store it. Okay, I did store it. Good. I'm, I'm not getting a chance to put <laughs> do my finisher. At least they let me store it in that clusterfuck. Okay. <clears throat> Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, look at that, dude. Ooh, knock him out. Boom, look at that elbow. Boom, look at that elbow. Pin him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm real quick, dude. Just end the match. The Rock already got up? What the fu- uh, I mean, I guess he is, like, completely fresh. He's taken, like, no damage, so that would make sense that he was up already, but I would hope it'd be a little bit longer for him to get back in. <clears throat> oh, no. Ooh. Boom, look at that DDT. Wow, I'm killing Shelton. I didn't think I was killing Shelton, but, like, I kind of am killing Shelton. No, don't tag out. Don't tag out, you son of a bitch. He tagged out. He knew he couldn't. He he knew he couldn't cut it. <clears throat> That's a. I love the mocap. Not mocap, actually. None of that was mocap. Um, I don't think any of the games were mocap. Uh, games? Excuse me. Uh, I don't think any of the moves were mocap in this game. I think it was all uh, animated within the game, which is why everything looks so impactful. Because you can only make things look, uh, you know so impactful in uh in real life so god damn it rock i swear to god don't <sighs> he keeps reversing man all i'm trying to do all i'm trying to all i'm trying to do get turn your ass around bruh bruh rock i swear to god rock get your ass over here get him with the choke slam he kicked out yeah yeah fucking reversed it of course he did <clears throat> The Rock's the only one I'm worried about in this, because he's the only one that's high rated. Actually, you know what? I trained up MVP, and I think he's high rated now, too, so that's no good. Because <clears throat> I got mad when I, he got eliminated real quick at the Rumble. <laughs> Ooh, no. Ooh. So, oh, okay. So I don't know why they tagged Shelton back in. Shelton's the most beat up of them all, so he should have tagged an MVP. But then again, within my rivalry, that would make sense that he didn't tag an MVP because MVP wants nothing to do with the Undertaker, dude. Wow, they're helping me build my own story, dude. Wow, look at that advanced AI, dude. What a what a what a nice pair of individuals. <clears throat> no, don't tag out. <clears throat> God damn it. Look, I'm, blo I'm blocking the way. You can't tag out if I'm laying. Oh, he's going to drag me out? Are you kidding me? <clears throat> no, don't tag out. You're not tagging out. You're not tagging out. He wants to tag out so bad. Oh, got him. I'm dragging your ass away from your corner, sir. You are not tagging out if I have anything to say about it. What the fuck? There we go. Stomp his ass a little bit. Nope. Boom. Got him. He's over. It's over for him. It's over. Get him with a choke slam. He didn't reverse it. Nice. Okay. All I have to do is... Okay. I gotta go knock them off. I gotta go knock them off. Oh, okay. No, it's over. Yeah, he's... Bro, hit him. There we go. Jesus. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Pin him. Pin him. Pin him. Pin him. Pin him. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. Rock, don't go back in. Boom. Look at that. One, two, three. Easy. Peasy, dude. Got him. Got him good. <clears throat> that was actually easier than I was expecting it to be, but, you know, 
It is what it is, you know. It's uh, when when somebody's as good as me, you know what I'm saying. Not to toot my own horn, you know. But when somebody is as good as, you know, me at this piece of shit game. Um, you know, it's just, it's too easy. You know what I'm saying? It's too easy. Unless it's against Ray, or unless it's against Batista. Then I get my ass whooped 90% of the time. Because, well, not even Ray anymore. Because now I know when I'm not even hurt, just pin him and he automatically uses it. The AI don't know how to time the possum pin. It's just the first pin you do, they use it. Um, but, um, yeah, man. <sighs> Batista's a pain in the ass to play against. He just destroys you. On to our main event of the evening. Speaking of uh, pieces of shit to play against, we are going to be playing against John Cena. It's time to put Gregory Helms up 3-0 and oh in this best of seven series. Know what I'm saying? And to do that, I'm going to have to take a sip of this uh, PC, dude. Because, uh, you know, John Cena's overpowered as shit. 97 rated. Uh, Gregory Helms is like 86 rated. So, big disadvantage, you know. I've won the last two. Hopefully, I don't have to resort to my bullshit tactic this time. But we'll see. Oh man, please sponsor me, dude. So good. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? My time is now, now. You can't see me. My time is now, now. It's the franchise, boy. I'm shining now, now. You can't see me. My time is now. Your time is now to lose, Jonathan. It's been your time to lose for two straight weeks, and we're about to make it a third straight week, boy. You're going to lose. I'm going to knock that fucking hat off your head. I'm going to smack you so hard your hair is going to grow back, you piece of trash. <clears throat> Come on, bro. I'm going to whoop his ass. I'm going to whoop his ass, dude. <clears throat> now it's time for uh, the main event's entrance, you know what I'm saying? Gregory Helms, the main man. The main man of the... Oh, his Titan Tron's broke. His Titantron is broken. The thing that's weird to me, though, his Titantron on the stage was broken. His video package, I guess I should say. His um, and on the preview thing down there on the name card, it's broken. But when when we loaded in and it showed the very top of the stadium, that like stadium TV that hangs in the middle, it wasn't broken on that. So I don't really understand why it wasn't broken on that. But yeah, man, no Titantron for uh, you, boy Gregory Helms this week. A big oof. You know what I'm saying? Won't change the fact that he's going to whoop some ass, but, you know. We won't be able to see that awesome middle rope, uh... You know. It's time. It's time. It's time. It's time to grab a big fat W, dude. Um... Yeah, man, we couldn't see that middle rope uh, neckbreaker that I love that's not in the game, unfortunately. <sighs> or at least I don't think it's in the game, you know? Alright. Alright, dude. Here's my game plan, right? If he starts whooping my ass too much, I take off my do-rag and I just choke him with it. You know, that's my, that's my uh, strategy there. You know what I'm saying? Ashley, on our loading screen, she was not good at all. Uh, another example of uh, when they used to just hire women based on their looks and not their wrestling ability. You had, at least like her era had good people like Beth and like Mickey and shit like that holding the division down, you know, while there were still the uh, people like Ashley. But, bruh, don't make me start this early, okay? Because I will start it early. I'll get, I'll, get, I'll get started on it real quick if you want to be a piece of sh Oh no, get out, get out, get out. I'll do it early, man. I'll start it early. I'll start it early. Don't think I won't. Don't think I won't, Jonathan. Don't think I won't, Jonathan. I'm a heel, dude. I'm a big ol' heel. Oh, no. He reversed. Oh, no. <laughs> get up. Helms, get up. All right. I'm out. Little bitch. Got him. Look at that, dude. Ooh. Okay, he reversed. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, look at that. Uppercut. European uppercut. Okay. Let's go top rope and let's get him with an elbow. He reversed. Of course he did. Of course he did. 
Oh god, I don't know why I keep putting myself through this, man. I don't know why I keep putting myself through this, man. It's the worst. Why do I keep putting myself- He reverses everything! What the fuck, dude? Stop. Get out of the ring. Why didn't he get out of the ring when I told him to, man? I got- I, I was pressing A to get out of the ring. And he gets out of the ring like a year later. And it's like, bruh. Oh my god. Bro, what the fuck? I did my grapple before he did his strike. How did his strike hit first? Fuck off. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Stomp the back of his head, dude. Ooh. Oh, no. Come on, bro. Huh. Oh, look at that, dude. Got him. Go up top, go up top, go up top, go up top, go up top. Do a good old legged drop. Boom. It actually hit. I'm so shocked that it hit. Get him with the good old one of those. Stomp him a little bit. Get him. Oh, no. Get him with the... Nope. Oh, no. Oh, this is it for me. This is it for me. Oh, no. He's gonna whoop my... Dude, don't do not do it. John. Oh, I actually reversed it. Holy shit, dude. Whoop. Nope. Never mind. He reversed. Okay. Stop. Jonathan. Jonathan? Jonathan? Please? What if I What if I ask politely? What if I say please? Will you um, cease your assault if I said please? Because uh, I'm giving you, I've, I'm giving you a chance to end this civilly right now. Because if you don't, uh, if if you don't end this civilly, you know, when I am asking nicely, if you don't end this while I'm being polite with you, I will come at you with the north. Okay, so don't fucking, don't you fuck. Just, I'm getting out. Nope. <laughs> nope. There we go. Nice old reset. <laughs> Stomp his ass. Come on, bro. Come on, Jonathan. Come on, Jonathan. Oh, what the fuck? Go for it again. There we go. This time I have my finisher. It actually hit. Oh my god. It's not going to be able to beat him, so I'm going to have to beat him a bit more. But I did get the Shining Wizard off, and that's going to get me closer to victory. All right. Come on, Cena. Come on, Cena. I'm going to whoop your ass. I'm going to whoop that ass. You know what I'm saying? Come on. Let's not. Let's no. Let's let's not do this. Uh, yeah, there we go. The strikes, I don't like. You know, the grapples, I can reverse. You know, the grapples, I don't really mind. The strikes, oh, I don't really fuck with the strikes. You know, I can't really reverse them all that well. Uh, <clears throat> Ooh, look at that. Submission from your boy. Boom. Oh, he broke out. Okay, no. Uh, get out of the ring. Get out of the ring. Gregory. There we go. Taunt me, bitch. Taunt me, little bitch. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Come on, get your ass over here. Get your ass. Get your ass. <laughs> oh, he didn't reverse it. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I actually beat him with some relative ease this week. No way. Holy shit. Now he's going to kick out because he's right in the fucking ropes. Okay, drag him. Pin him. Don't kick out, please, Jonathan. John Chana, please. Oh my god, I actually beat him with relative ease this week. I am shooketh, as the kids say. You know what I'm saying? Holy shit. Okay, so that means Gregory Helms, your boy, is 3 and O oh in this best of seven series. So now, from this point on, it is sudden death for your boy, John Chana. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, he's gonna have to, he's gonna have to, you know, step up big time. You know what I'm saying? Step up two. Is that the sequel to Step Up One? Yes, it is. <clears throat> he's gonna have to step up. You know what I'm saying? He's gonna have to, he's gonna have to stop being a little bitch and, you know, get, get some victories in. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna skip this victory animation because the victory animations don't really serve any purpose. It wasn't a generic one, at least. So, yeah, we got Bobbington Lashley on the loading screen there. Wow. Uh, okay, what did we get for our show? We got three stars. Excuse me. What the fuck? Excuse. I'm adding this up because that's not three stars. That's we. Our lowest was three and a half. This is a robbery. What the fuck? Four. Okay. That one got a three and a half. That one got a three and a half. That got a fucking four. And that got a three and a half. Okay. That's a four. That's like, that's 3.7. But rounding that up, that's a fucking four. Okay. I got, I got robbed, dude. Dude, Raw had this exact same card last week. Didn't they? 
No? This week. Somebody had this exact same card. Like a week ago. Was it me? Did I have the exact same card? Yeah, I did. Okay. <laughs> that was me. I had the exact same ratings. Except this week, I was half a rating lower for some reason. I don't know why. That's trash. That is literal trash. I got 3% for something, though. For an injury-free month. I have injuries turned off. That's not really an accomplishment. But I'll, I'll take the points, Vince. Why not? All right. The Rock, we can renew him for a solid five weeks. And then we can build some people up. Take a look at my rivalries. Everything's still thumbs up. Boy, you know what it is. The only one I'm kind of worried about is um, Chavo and Ray. Because I have five weeks till Great American Bash. And then on top of that, it'll be another four or five weeks till SummerSlam. Or like three weeks to SummerSlam or something like that. Um, here, how long is it to SummerSlam now? Air one clean. Do I not have any clean left? Okay. <laughs> Fucking great, dude. Um, yeah, your boy CM Punk, right there. Um, Popularity-wise, everybody's doing all right. You know what I'm saying? Except for a select few down here that I have to bump up. I'm gonna have to bump up John Cena because the fact that I am getting three and a halfs with him and and. Um, Gregory Helms is trash, so we'll do a trophy date with your boy John Channa. So he's 87 now. That should bring him to what? What is this going to be? Plus 5. Okay, that's fine. 92 will do. Uh, we'll give Edge one because Edge is part of a good fucking rivalry that we need to do well. So we need him bumped up plus 5 we'll give him we'll give him one more yeah cuz i think his his popularity not an autograph signing that only gives like plus 1 uh, his popularity is more important than stone cold's as of this moment okay so he was at a 73 now he's at an 83 that's fine um we'll we'll do one more with him actually because yeah why not there you go Plus five, there we go. So now, I don't, I don't even remember what the fuck I just said his popularity was before, but it's an 88 now. John Cena is up to a 92. All right, everything's good in here. Next week, we'll have to uh, improve Stone Cold's popularity. Uh, probably Shelton's as well. I don't want Shelton to be the lowest rated. Uh, I don't really count Kenny, by the way. So <laughs> Kenny's always going to be the lowest rated. So the lowest rated important people, I don't want that to be Shelton. I, I have my roster is stacked though like if, if you look at my roster right like this is absolutely stacked like Jeff Hardy right boom MVP right character wise boom at that time in the ring maybe not so much but character wise boom you know Ray boom Triple H oh look at that like Undertaker Punk you know Gregory Helms Randy Chavo Cena Rock you know what I'm saying The Rock you know what I'm saying Sean Edge, Matt, Shelton, Benjamin, who should have been in this goddamn game, but he wasn't, so I had to create him, and I'm very pissed off still to this day. But at the same time, that means I got him real cheap, so it actually kind of worked out, but that's okay. Uh, and then Stone Cold, you know, and then Kenny Dykstra, not so much, but that's neither here or there. Rivalries are still doing good. I'm still keeping them fresh. I'm really, I'm really happy that this is three thumbs. I'm hoping I can keep it as three thumbs up up until SummerSlam, where it's scheduled to end. And then after that, we will do another rivalry. Um, you know, what I'm saying, um, yeah, man, we fixed Edge's popularity at least, so that's good. Uh, let's set up the card for next week. Let me pull up my. Uh, Excel spreadsheet here. Okay, so June 21st. Perfect. Okay. <clears throat> so, am I in match one right now? Yes, I am. Okay. This match is going to be a six man tag to start things off. Just a six man normal tag. Or should I do elimination? Should I do elimination? Or should I do six man tornado? We'll do a six-man tornado just because I think I'm going to play this because I want certain people to win. Um, Got to have MVP. No, he's not in this match. Whoops. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> okay. So, Sean can come back down. 
here. Uh, Triple H can move on over. And then this is going to be, who is it going to be? Jonathan Cena. And um, then up here will have to be Gregory Helms. Matt Hardy can get bumped out for Edge. And then Randall can be there. <clears throat> We're starting off with that. This gives a nice little break to uh, Cena and Gregory Helms. Um, I'm, I'm happy to find out that, that doing three one-on-one -on -one matches in a row didn't sour the rivalry off the bat. That was a nice thing to be made aware of. Because if that would have soured the rivalry right away, that would have sucked. Because I have, I have this bra uh, match as like a break, and then I have three more one-on-ones, obviously, for the rest of the best of seven, and then a break, and then the bash. So, yeah, if, if, uh, it would have ruined my plans. Um, hopefully this works. I hope it does. I really, wish, I really, really do hope it does. Uh, we're just doing Stone Cold versus Jeff. <clears throat> and then uh, promo is obviously going to be money because we're broke. Advertising, there we go. And then the next match is going to be uh, da, 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 ba, 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 Punk versus Matt. No, that's Randy. Matt, there we go. Um, yeah, that's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, I think I think that will advance the rivalry still. I'll find out after. I don't really care. <laughs> <laughs> if it ends the rivalry, I'll just restart it until the bash, and it'll get one thumbs up, and it's whatever. It could get up to two thumbs up at least with uh, the, <clears throat> the way I'm doing it now, which would be nice, you know? But, yeah. Because <clears throat> uh, I, like, they will be together at the bash, uh, so it would help that match that they're going to be in that I have planned. Uh, what is this match? The match four for next week. This match is um, another one on one. Again, picking Randy by mistake. Uh, the Rock and your boy Shelton. So basically, the premise for this match is they're going to get mad at each other over who cost their team the match last week against The Undertaker. Uh, they're going to blame each other and they're going to be like, you know what? I'll prove that you were the weak link by beating you tonight. And then they'll be like, no, I'll prove that you're the weak link. And I'll be like, okay. And that'll be the end of the promo. <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, then the main event of the evening is a little bit... Uh, I don't like tag team matches, but whatever. I made it anyways just to keep things somewhat fresh within the game's algorithm. We already have a tornado, so I'm going to make this a normal, which is going to be fucking garbage. Uh, MVP, and, uh, I'm looking at the wrong thing. Uh, no, I'm looking at the right thing. Chavo and MVP versus your boy Ray Ray and your boy The Undertaker. Who else? You know what I'm saying? I think I've used the whole roster. I think I've been using the whole roster every week, except for Kenny. Except last week, I think I, or this week, the one, the games that I just played, the matches that I just played, excuse me, I think I used everybody on the roster. You know what I'm saying? I think it did. Oh well. I think I've been using everybody but Kenny, and then last, and then in this episode, I used everybody, including Kenny. So yeah, six man tornado to start things off between those rivalries. Uh, this rivalry broken up into two separate matches because I already did uh, Jeff vs. Punk with the managers, and then. Um, and I did uh, Matt and Stone Cold with the managers, and now I just switched the matches, but without managers this time. Whoa, dude, what a wacky twist. Um, and then The Rock versus Benjamin, seeing who's the weak link from last week, and then this is a tag team match because it's a tag team match. Um, so, yeah, that's uh, that'll be the card for next week. Let's see what Raw and ECW did. Raw got a three and a half. Okay, they have a new women's champion, or a current women's champion, whatever. Okay. Wait, what is this? Oh, they have their pay-per-view this month. Hmm. Oh, they have their pay-per-view now. Okay, so th I should have made, like, title matches on this card. But, um, you know, oh well. Oh well. <laughs> Fuck it. You know? Fuck it. That's fine. That is fine. You know, whatever. Uh, uh, whatever, you know? You know, it's okay. It's okay, you know? You know, it's okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Whatever, dude. Who cares? Um, 
Yeah, okay, we will go ahead and take a look at the fan support before ending things off. Uh, we are on the down a little bit, which is bullshit because we're the better show and we have been from the start, but that's okay. That's okay. You know, I'm used to being fucked over by the game. I don't know why Michelle McCool is number one again. She really shouldn't be. Some One of my people should be at the top of the Power 25. What the fuck? What the fuck, dude? Undertaker just beat three people. And fucking Batista and Michelle McCool are above him on the Power 25? Excuse me? Get, get, the, get that shit out of here, dude. Fuck off. Um... Good thing JBL is not like, oh, your financials are low this week because I would have fucking smacked his cowboy hat off. Five star rating pay per view match. Look at that. We've been fucking killing it, you know? Not not the early pay per views, but like more recent pay per views, you know, after I got all my trades done and shit like that. Or like most of my trades done uh, last season and then this season. And, you know, it's been good. Five star rating normal match only twice. That's not too good. Uh, five star rating pay per view show just the once. Yikes, five star rating streak. You know, that's really hard to do. I don't think anybody's done that, so, you know, number one superstar, I've done that way more than twice, but that's whatever. I've I've won every single joint paper you goddamn right I have. <clears throat> we talk in, we talk in uh Survivor series, we talk in Rumble, we talk in Mania. I don't think they do anything at SummerSlam for it, or do they? They don't, I don't think. Then how do I have four if I only did three? No, then they must do. Ha they must have a cross-brand SummerSlam match too. Then. Okay. Okay. I see. I see. I see how it is. <clears throat> All right. We'll go ahead and save it. There we go. Yep. Save it. Overwrite it. All that bullshit. Whatever. Who cares? Okay. So that will be it for this week's episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if this is the first video that, watch, that you are watching from the series, you can check out a link to the playlist at the end cards at the end of the video, as well as a link to my SmackDown vs. Raw 2011 and John Cena Road to WrestleMania that I will be doing. Uh, I think it's just finishing up around the time this is coming out. And uh, also, be sure to check out my uh, WWE 2K19 career mode that I finally started after I got the game a month late. <clears throat> so, yeah, there's a, like a one hour, ten minute video to premiere it, I think, that I uploaded. So, yeah, and then that will be coming out recent, uh, fairly regularly as well. Uh, I'm also doing All-Stars. I'm doing a lot of shit, dude. Just, uh, you know, if you go under the playlist section of my channel. You'll be able to see all the series I have done and am currently doing. So if you're a fan of the older wrestling games, check me out. You might like what you see. And, um, yeah, man, as always with this series, be sure to leave suggestions down in the comments of trades, rivalries, matches, uh, match types between people, stuff like that. And if I like it, I will take it into consideration. Um... And potentially implement it. I, I have already with the Cheating Girlfriend storyline. I just tweaked it a little because, yeah. So, if you have any ideas, be sure to leave them down in the comments. And, um, yeah, man. Follow me on Twitter. Link in the description. Follow me on nothing else because I don't have anything else. But, sponsor me PC, you know what I'm saying? You know, you know what I'm saying? Help your brother out. And, um, yeah, man. If you guys enjoyed it, like, subscribe. Share it all your friends, all that good shit. Be sure to turn on notifications so you never miss an episode because YouTube likes to zuck your boy. And I'll see you guys next time.